So what is up guys, within 24 hours we have with us everything you need to know about the iPhone SE 2 from its launch date, when it's going to be launching, what are going to be its specifications, which display is coming, is there going to be Face ID or Touch ID and even what is going to be its pricing and just everything we know about the iPhone SE 2 in 24 hours. So guys, no other video on YouTube will tell everything about it but guys, today's video is specially dedicated on the iPhone SE 2 so hope you like today's video and without any further ado, let's get started. So guys, first of all, analyst Minchi Ko has predicted that the iPhone SE 2 is coming in the first month of 2020. Means guys, in the Jan in January, Apple is going to be conducting an event or just going to be launching this iPhone. Well guys, second thing I want to say. Like guys, it is expected to be in the second week of January 2020. That is it for the launch date. But what is going to be the iPhone SE 2? Well guys, the number one thing which I want to say is iPhone SE 2 is going to be the same like the iPhone SE what it had inspired from the iPhone 6s. In short, if I were to say guys, just the iPhone 8 which we have with us, you know, a 2 to 3 years old iPhone up to this point and now guys what Apple is going to be doing is going to be taking the same body design but they are going to be doing one more thing and that is keeping the body same the same size and same form factor even the same display the same back camera but what you are getting with this is Apple's A13 Bionic chipset A13 is the most power efficient and the fastest chip Apple makes and guys there is no other smartphone which gives iPhone you know uh, the this kind of powerful chipset below $500 and now we are at the pricing of the iPhone SE 2 well the iPhone SE 2 is going to be kicking off the market kicking off Apple shelves and everything it is going to be starting at $399 yes guys for $400 you can get the iPhone SE 2 in next years or you can say uh, in new year so guys just I want, I'm pretty much like impressed like $400 in India you can get it around me for 35 to 40,000 Indian rupees again this only makes one sense and that is Apple wants budget friendly iPhone and not just that you're getting touch ID with the, this iPhone SE 2 and you're not getting face ID that's a downside but again face uh, touch ID is even faster and more secure than the face ID system and not just that guys the body the overall body itself like the iPhone coming from the iPhone 6, 6s, the 7, the 8 again this iPhone SE 2 or whatever it is going to be called as it's going to be dope again most of you guys want the bezel list and notch full display with beautiful technology but again this iPhone 8 display is not at all bad now you must of course be confused that why is Apple planning to make cheaper iPhones even in fact Apple has dropped the pricing of the iPhone 11 by $50 than of the 10R and now it's available for $699 and like Apple is still going for cheaper variants because Apple has got it you know the simple psychology and that is just in, in spite of making like a product with more volume and less pricing is more beneficial than making a product with less volume and more price and of course Apple has got it that if we want to have profit we have to go with this strategy so that we will of course not only cover a larger share in the market but guys also will win people's trust and also give people an upgrade you know people in India are still stuck on iPhone 6 and 6s and just because the pricing of the latest iPhones is not at all making a lot of sense and now the iPhone 10 has prices drop to 40,000 Indian rupees so most of you or most of the people are upgrading towards it and if Apple will come with this alternative it's definitely going to be appreciated and guys I hope that you have liked today's video and guys just I'm always there to give you the latest updates regarding Apple ecosystem and if there are any leaks and news guys consider subscribing if you like Apple content and guys thanks for watching don't forget to like this video and also leave a comment that what are your thoughts and are you excited for this iPhone so thanks for watching stay tuned for more videos and